And what's up, everybody? It's your boy Uchi and my brother Uch, and we are Hey Kids back again. Once again, how y'all doing today? Under some other conditions, we're just trying to get y'all used to a little bit some extra aside from Dragon Ball Super reactions. So expect to see some other stuff in the near future. But today we got. A Death Note live action Netflix adaption. Adaptation is the right way. I just wanted that to rhyme. Trailer. And it's a teaser, so it's only going to be like a minute long. We kind of wanted to see it, check it out, and have you guys check out our reaction because I haven't seen it yet. He hasn't seen it yet. I literally forgot that this was going to happen because people don't know that Death Note is so popular that there's many other adaptations. You have the terrible live action movies that Japan did first. But then you have the live action TV series that Japan did afterwards, way after the fact. After these three movies, you have the TV series that took place in summer of 2015. It was only 11 episodes and it covered the entire series. And that, in my opinion, and Brother Ooch, because you like it too, right? It was fire. It was great. It was a great refreshing of the storytelling of Death Note. And here we have Netflix's U.S adaptation so let's see if they did the show some justice are you worried i don't know you guys you're gonna wait and see yep all mm -hmm. right so let's let's check it out oh wow Oh, it's a film. So they're making the whole movie. Whoa. The human whose name is written in the snow shall die. Hey, yo. <laughs> Yo, August 25th. Damn, that's crazy. So they're literally trying to make an answer to Japan's version, I'm guessing. Because if they're going to release it during summertime, that's literally when they did it two years ago in Japan. So what are your impressions off of that? That's okay. <laughs> it's okay? Yeah. I see, like... I don't know how it's going to act. Though. It's a blonde dude. It's an American <laughs> guy. That's what I'm saying. It's the U. It's the U.S. version. So that that means that a lot of the scenarios that happened in Death Note, since it mainly takes place in Japan, I'm not sure if they're gonna kind of like do similar versions of that in like New York City or Los Angeles or any other major cities that take place in in the United States. I mean, that kind of asks the question like, where exactly is this gonna happen? And it looks like. There's a little bit more romance. That's something that we tend to do when we adapt things. So when things go Hollywood, you always they always have to throw that kind of stuff in there. We saw, I don't know if it was Light or whoever was making out, getting some cheeks with some other girl. I, I don't know, couldn't tell. But the one actor that I do remember that actually has a role in this movie, because I did not know it was gonna be a movie, it's actually a movie, is Ryuk. Do you know, oh, actually, do you remember the actor that played the Green Goblin? You don't remember that guy? The guy that inspired the first Spider-Man trilogy. He was, he was, he was the Green Goblin, he was Harry's dad. I haven't watched Spider-Man in years. <laughs> <laughs> that dude, yeah, I'm gonna show a graphic right now. Remember him? Oh yeah. <laughs> That's the guy that they're getting to voice, Ryuk. That's the one dude I remember. And what's funny is, I was almost trying to imagine Light being the one dude from High School Musical. Because people kept making fan pictures. He's been in all these other movies now. And he, people are already forgetting that he was from High School Musical, but I didn't. This new kid, I don't know. I wanna see who they get for L. I wanna see what L looks like. And I basically just wanna, like, I'm looking forward to seeing this because I appreciate adaptations as long as they keep the core elements and properties of the series there 
if they make drastic changes with like no reasoning whatsoever and it's just like random which is basically what happened to the original movies in japan i'm not gonna like it he's not gonna like it let me tell you we were in japan seeing attack on titan exactly let me know what you guys thought in the comments below like share subscribe hit us up on twitter let me know what you guys thought about the death note live action netflix adaptation trailer and remember stay tuned keep your eyes peeled because dragon ball super ain't the only thing we're gonna react to i'll just leave it at that see ya